Okay, on to match number four. This time we're taking on Thadok the Thief. One moment her minions are gone, or are there, the next, gone. Whoops. Uh, so her ability is Tactical Retreat, return a friendly minion to your hand. That is cool, actually. Uh, I'm guessing there's going to be a lot of interesting combos coming out of here. That said, uh, let's go ahead and jump in and see if we can get our fourth win. I like that art. It's cool. It's like a Doctor Doom Sylvanas mashup. Alright, as usual, pretty okay opening hand. Love unidentified elixir. I'm really excited to see or to use it for the first time rather. Grand Archivist. Not a great turn one draw, but we're gonna we're about to get small backpacks, so not a huge deal. Elixir of Hope. So it gives a minion two two death rattle, return it to your hand. That's pretty cool. That'd be okay on Northshire. None of my minions, I'm trying to think, there wouldn't be any minion it'd be particularly super duper strong with, except for someone who I just want to keep on the board, like someone like Akanai Soul Priest. Did he really just... Sweet. I love a stupid AI. Right away. There's our Dragon Soul, and we already have Radiant in hand. Uh, we almost have everything we'll need to trigger Dragon Soul once, which is great. Really, dude? I see. Like, seriously. Oh, these these AIs are hilarious. I knew he was gonna bounce it again, but what, who who freezes a priest? <laughs> the hell. All right. Um, Divine Spirit is mostly just for triggering this combo. Uh, however, we're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna Dragon Soul still, um, because I was tempted there a little bit to drop Elixir of Hope, but it's not really worth it, because he's just gonna be able to freeze again here, case in point. Oh my god. And now he's gonna bounce one of them again. This would be really effective against, like, a weapon deck. Oh, it's actually gonna be very effective, because he is, I didn't even notice he played the Rogue Quest. Oh, that's not good. That's really not good. Okay, wow, it ramped up fast. Alright. Um, let's... Get at him, I guess. Um, is it worth Elixir of Hoping yet? I don't know that it is. Hmm. I mean, he is about to trigger this next turn. <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, no, it's not, because he can still remove it. Whew, that's not good. All right, we need to Holy Smite. <gasps> And that's really all I can do. I see how this deck works. That's so bad. Good thing he can't afford to play Crystal Core yet, but this may be the wall. Oh god. I need AoEs. No, you're not Holy Nova. Uh, let's see if we can discover... Oh, no, we won't. No, we will be able to afford it. Give me Holy Nova. Oh, come on. Uh, hmm. I don't really have a great play against this board. Power Word Shield. Hope we get Holy Nova from this. Oh, come on. Killing me. All right, well, and now we can't, wait, now we can trigger Dragon Soul, though, so let's go ahead and do that. Right away. And draw another card. Hey, that's awesome. Nice, actually, that's way, way better than I was thinking. Now, unfortunately, he can Crystal Cork and do really dumb combos with his 5-5 five five there, um, but I should be able to remove it without too much difficulty. Hmm. Now I get the Holy Nova. Let's see. This is actually kind of tough here. I'd rather not... Well, actually, it's not. I'll just bump this into it. Um, we don't have three spells. 
let's go ahead and save the spells we have for now, and I think we'll drop Akanai Soul Priest so we can start pinging stuff off. Yeah. And a Fairy Dragon, because Fairy Dragon rocks. Right away. We are taking some damage to our Northshire, but we can always resummon it. <coughs> uh, now he doesn't have a charge, so... The charge was the thing I was most concerned about. <clears throat> that, oof. That is rough. Oh no, he took away my soul priest. Oh, that's... Uh-oh, you guys. I think that's uh, gonna be it. Why did I just draw two cards? All right, um, Holy Nova. I'll get to draw a card off of it. Hmm. Then it won't remove anything, but it will allow me to make a more efficient trade. He's gonna get another 5-5 five, five taunt next turn. Let's Power Word Shield this and see what we get. Shadow Word Pain. That is literally useless for the rest of this game. Okay. Could be Violet Teachering right now think we need to be a little more aggressive. I mean, I just need to remove everything I can here, but he's got basically infinite tempo. He can play a 5-5 five, five taunt every single turn mm, for 2 mana, or for 3 mana. Mm. <laughs> I think I Divine Spirit this and hope that it he attacks into it. Boy, that is tough. Um, I think I gotta... No, I want a Holy Nova to take out as much as I can. I still do. If I Holy Nova, I can remove this, remove this, and then hit him for three. Hmm, this is really tough. I'm going to Divine Spirit this in hopes that it becomes a huge target. Then we'll light spawn, which we'll trade for one of the five fives. Take out the taunt here. Right away. There you go. There's a decent chance that he will. Oh no. Oh, he didn't get the combo. Oh, but he can afford to replay his minions here. Oh, he went for the North Shire. That's actually not what I expected. Ah, because then he can replay it even more efficiently. Boy, do I wish I had a board clear that could deal with five fives in this deck. Hmm, that could have gone worse. Kind of wish I had taken that other Mind Blast earlier, though. Um, Holy Nova is even worse this turn than it was last turn. Let's go for... I don't even know what spells I have left in my deck. Hmm... Grand Archivist is tempting, though, just for the fun of it. Uh, I can remove this, hit him for 5, uh, 10, and then he wins pretty much no matter what. Okay, well, in that case, let's see what the Archivist is like, because we've lost. What? Oh, does it add it to your hand? No, it does cast it. What did it cast? Well, that was weird. Oh well. <clears throat> Whatever it cast must have fizzled. Alright, well there you have it, our first dungeon run. Sorry it didn't go longer, I obviously would have preferred that we had gone for a full, uh, <laughs> a full eight runs. But, you know, that could have been worse. What, what did we get? Four in? Three in? We got to the fourth one? Gotcha. Okay, well, for our very first run going in totally blind, I'm not unhappy with that. It's a bit of a bummer, though, that I don't think you actually get a, like, gold or any, or card payout from this. No, you don't. But that's okay. It's actually really fun, in my opinion, and I really hope you guys enjoyed. This is, I know, a bit of a departure from our usual constructed play, but uh, still very fun all the same. Let's go ahead and open the pack we got, since this is our first dungeon run. Give me something good. We got, uh, at least we got a new ruby, uh, a new spell stone, but 
everything else already had. Ah, well. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed this episode, please be sure to like, subscribe, and leave a comment below so that I know. As always, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time.